Hey everybody, it's Jared. You're watching Revert to Means. It is February 1st. Wow, already in February. Hope everybody's doing well. Um, take a few seconds. Stay tuned. I got more to come. I'm going to make a few stops here just showing you what's going on here in uh, Central Ventura. There's too much to show um, for lease signs everywhere. I filmed here about uh, last summer um, and the, the for lease signs are, are just they're everywhere so I wanted to point this out to you uh, we've got office space light industrial um, take three seconds give this a thumbs up subscribe hit the uh, the share button send it out to friends and family and also um, hit the bell notification I'd appreciate it website is down below but um, right there behind me and then check out right here right over there they're everywhere folks I've just been driving around doing some work today but um, this is this is bananas. Um, everything's just increasing tenfold. Um, I could make a hundred stops today in this little, you know, area of I don't know what five square miles. But this is uh, Central Ventura. I just drove by a Target, and um, there's RVs, homeless people dumping their um, their sewage into the streets. I didn't want to film that. Um, it's unfortunate, but um, stay tuned. More to come. Quick shout out to a couple of my longtime subscribers. Johnny Midas out in the desert. Hope you're doing well. Uh, Jack the Rabbit, uh, Punker for Real. And wanted to mention a couple channels too. Market Mania, Market Mania Canada. Check out Luke. He's got a great channel up in uh, Canada, eh? <laughs> um, and Gun Girl Prepper, she's a new YouTuber, got some good um, good stuff. So stay tuned, more to come. Before I forget to mention, I was out um, in eastern Ventura County this morning, um, out towards Valencia. Um, one of my longtime customers, if you've, you've seen my prior videos, um, I'm in the wholesale maintenance uh, repair operations business. Um, so um, anything consumable items that, you know, a, a fleet of trucks or school buses need to need to fix their fleet uh, private business up to government um, but one of my longtime customers folks and I've known this was coming it was just awkward to drive by their lot they 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 uh, leased about a 10 acre site out towards Valencia by a magic mountain and they finally moved about three weeks ago um, to Texas they're in the excavation and uh, grading business um, but they moved out to Texas and their whole former um, job site, their yard, has big old for lease signs. Um, but that was quite a ways away, about 40 minutes away. I didn't want to start filming out there and then come back to the coast. So stay tuned. I appreciate everybody watching. All right, I'll turn my camera around here and uh, show you. People are living in their RVs, folks. And they're dumping... Um, Sorry for the big rib going by. There's a truck driving school. But uh, very sad. Very unfortunate indeed. Here's another vacant building, folks. And with the homeless in the area, shopping carts, police tape, Big empty building. No trespassing. I'll go down this alley for everybody here. See what's going on. And I'm right, this all backs up to this part of, of Ventura is off of Market Street. Backs up to um, all agriculture area. But just a, a sad sight to see. I'm gonna pull over right here. I wanted to bring up something. Check this out. I was reading on KUSI.com. It's a news station down in San Diego. Excellent video they had. You know, and I don't do politics on here, as I've said in videos past. I'm an independent. I don't care what side of the aisle you're on. Check out what our governor here in uh, California, lovely Governor Mr. Newsom, he was caught at the, uh, the Rams-Niners game over the weekend along with Mayor Garcetti of Los Angeles and the mayor of San Francisco. They were caught, photographed, and videoed, you know, not wearing their diapers around their face. You know, so, so 
it just makes me sick. Comment below. I'd love to know what you guys think. But um, the ironic thing, I just bring it up because, like I said, I don't care what side of politics you're on. I bring it up because of the hypocrisy. Made me think of the old movie Tombstone. Um, if you guys and gals have ever seen that. You know, Doc Holliday was played by Val Kilmer. There's a famous line in there. They're playing poker. And he says, uh, my hypocrisy knows no bounds. Well, that's those folks, you know. Do You do something and I won't do it. You make your kids do this and you guys do this, but I won't. How hip hypocritical is that? It, frankly, I don't get ticked off very often, but it's just, it doesn't tick me off. It's just, you know, it's so bad it makes you uh, want to laugh. Um, here's another big building right there. And like I said, I filmed here last summer, and there's still a lot of for lease signs. So stay tuned. I'm going to drive around a little bit more and got some some more stuff for you. Contact uh, Jim if you want any commercial real estate. It is uh, very prevalent here in Ventura. And ladies and gentlemen, I'm just driving in literally a uh, like a two three square mile area. Um, of this park, but I was telling you all this ag area right here, strawberries, uh, mainly strawberries, um, lettuce, things like that. There, that's a new Kaiser Permanente hospital that opened about uh, a couple years ago. Stay tuned. Appreciate you watching. Give it a thumbs up. This is the same I found it. Cause there's so many driveways and, and um, whatnot, but I filmed here in the summer, if you recognize this. Still all empty, all these small, uh, light, commercial, industrial. Um, some are open, I'm seeing, but the majority, I'd say about um, 70, 80% are, are empty. So don't forget, please subscribe. If you think you are subscribed, check again. Uh, the tube likes to uh, unsubscribe some people. So take care. More to come, comment down below. Check out the website down below, revert2means.com.
Oops, sorry, didn't pause it. <laughs> All right, I'm back. Sorry for that, uh, ladies and gentlemen. Had a little uh, issue there. Didn't pause the uh, the phone quite in time, but made it back to my place. Um, and once again, you know, I don't give financial advice, any type of advice on here. I'm just a guy with my phone, recording on YouTube, um, showing my observations and things I see to share with y'all. A couple notes I jotted down early this morning. Um, Goldman Sachs, they slashed their 2022 GDP forecast. Um, again, for the second or third time, I believe. But they are warning of a sharp deceleration in growth um, for this year. Shocker. Anybody else <laughs> surprised by that? I mean, you know, myself, Jeremiah Babe, a lot of others. We've been saying this, um, ladies and gentlemen. 2022 is just going to be a year of volatility, even though, I, you know, um, it's a little before 4 o'clock here today. But the Dow was up again today. NASDAQ was up. Uh, gold and silver um, were up slightly. Um, oil was up slightly. Um, uh, yeah, but this year is going to be a, a wild year. Uh, comment down below. I welcome your comments. Uh, let me know what uh, you, you folks think out there, what you're seeing in your cities, your towns, your counties, etc. Uh, one thing I just heard, in the, I had about a 10-minute drive back from where I was just filming. Um, I've been wanting to share this with everybody, but I, I always forget. This has been going on. There's a talk radio station um, out of L.A., um, it runs from uh, noon to three every day, uh, AM 790. If anybody's nearby, you can probably listen to it on the internet. Uh, it's uh, a great show, John Phillips show. Very, uh, It's a rarity to have such a show based out of L.A., but uh, they have just, it's kind of a comedy, a, a few hours of comedy, you know, people can call in. And this last, coming up on two years, has been a wild ride for everybody, um, indeed. Uh, but they were just talking again. They always poke fun of, um, if you don't know, I'll fill you in. Um, the public, public health director out of Los Angeles County, which I believe is maybe not physically the biggest county in the United States, uh, but it's probably, I think it's the, the most populated. The public health director is a, a lady named Dr. Barbara Ferrer, right? She, she, she's been saying, you know, I'm a doctor, this and that. She's not a doctor. You, she, 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 they were just saying and laughing, bust, made me bust up. She has a sociology degree, and she's a public health director making over 400 grand a year. Um, and she's the one that's been telling everybody, you know, wear this, get this, get the medicine. You know, you don't go out to eat, blah, 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 blah. And this is who we're, this is why, folks. I don't care what side are you on. You want to get med, get the medicine, go for it, you know, knock yourself out. You don't. Hey, that's, this is all our, what I'm getting at, this is our, our, our free will, our free choices as humans that God gave us. Um, and I, I don't care if you're religious or not, but every individual, we have individualistic free will, freedom of choice, right? And you get, you get these knuckleheads telling you what to do, and people have just taken the bait, and it's so sad. I feel so bad for people. I've been talking with a lot of friends and colleagues you know, this last year and a half to two years, and people just took the bait, and people like to be told what to do. So, let's go, Brandon. Um, I will wrap it up with this. Sorry to keep you going. Um, reading this morning to, uh, I guess this was yesterday. CBS News, maybe the morning show. They literally said, and I don't know if you guys have seen this. Comment down below. Um, love to know what you, what y'all think. Uh, CBS News Morning Show was telling viewers yesterday that Joe Rogan, you know, the Spotify um, guy, that, that Joe Rogan's been killing people. Okay. That's not a reach, but, you know, typical, once again, mainstream media. Um, <laughs> blows my mind. Um, you know, it's funny, I've been listening to Joe Rogan for probably about, um, even before he, he was on Spotify, um, I'd watch him, I'd listen to him on YouTube, probably the last four years, and uh, I was made fun of by a certain someone, <laughs> if you've caught my prior videos of my prior life when uh, uh, I had a nine-year relationship, but uh, it's just ironic, because 
Joe Rogan has pointed out, um, he had a social media post the other day, how, how things with what's been going on with this health crisis, um, things we were told six to nine months ago, 12 months ago, that were outlandish, hmm, kind of um, not so outlandish anymore, right? So I'm going to wrap it up with that, folks. Please give this a thumbs up, hit the bell notification, and you'll see all the newest videos coming out. Stay tuned. I'm going to have a good one. Um, either tomorrow or the next day, I'm going to be up north, in, up in Santa Barbara County. I'll be filming what's going on with the economy up there um, and everything else. So subscribe. Check out the website below. Check out Gun Girl Prepper, Market Mania Canada. Um, I would greatly appreciate it. Thank you for watching. Thanks for your time. Have a good evening. God bless.